Morning guys, so I'm just here, I just wanted to try out a new GridServe install and see how far things have come since uh, GridServe took over a couple of years now and they had a promise where first of all they were going to re-do um, all of the motorway services, replace all the old aging um, eco tristy highway um, kit, um, put more chargers in and then obviously branch out to the more local stuff. So the motorway stuff largely has been upgraded. Like the, the, the old units have been replaced with new units. Some places have had a lot more, some places haven't had quite as much of an upgrade. I think just depend on demand. But now we're starting to see um, pop-up sites like this. So where we are is Harrison Way in St. Ives uh, near Cambridge. Um, and it's got like things like Costa and McDonald's and stuff like that around it. And this is quite close to where I work, so I thought, oh, perfect opportunity to give it a go. Um, now this has got, let me just count behind me, one, two, three, four, it's got eight units. Um, I'm not sure what the charging speed on these ones, I'm only pulling about 70 odd kilowatts, but then I hadn't pre preconditioned or anything like that so it could be higher so these could well be these could possibly be a 150 kilowatt split if you know put it in the comments um they've got two units with ccs and chadamo so if you've got like nissan leafs and stuff like that you'll be able to charge them there and the rest are all pure one cabled ccs it's interesting that the uh, sites like this they haven't got um double cables on the CCS like they do in some of the service stations, but you know, probably not needed with this many here, perhaps at the moment. We'll see how um, it goes. Uh, this is a, I don't know, it's just before eight o'clock in the morning, so it's pretty empty. Um, I'm pretty sure this will probably, how it will be, it's uh, um, during the week, but then like the weekends, this will, could well get quite busy with, like I said, McDonald's and Costa and things like that being there, so. Um, it's 69 ki uh, 69p a kilowatt, so it's not, say, as cheap as, you know, charging on a Tesla supercharger, which I'm in at the moment, my Model Y. Um, but the good thing with uh, GridServe's one is that they only charge a pound holding fee, and then when you've finished, it will then work it out how much you've actually charged and stuff. So it's a lot better than some of them. Some of them are still charging ludicrous amounts up front. Osprey, uh, I think, are down to about five pounds, um, and that is. But there's some of the older, um, not quite as established people that are still using 25, 30, somebody up to a 50 pound, which is ridiculous. Um, but again, these ones, I just wanted to see how good they are. I mean, GridServe, to be honest, are rolling out what they what they said they're going to do. Apart from, I will say, they're big. Um, charging hubs like Braintree and like Norwich which are absolutely brilliant Gatwick I believe is in progress as we speak um, there's been no word on Stevenage which is the one that I'm really waiting for um, now they did say that they were meant to be breaking ground this year we're now in October nothing uh, I've been past the site a few times but there's nothing going on um, and they're meant to be opening in April next year or so which I just can't see happening um, so GridServe, if you're listening to this, give us some information, happy to do an interview or another chat with you guys, let's find out what's going on, especially for the Hearts EVs um, guys. Um, but yeah, um, it, it's good, it's doing what it needs to do, I thought I'd give this a go. It's quick and easy, it's contactless, so plug in, swipe your card, charge, easy, exactly how it should be. Obviously even easier in a Tesla, like if you're in on a Tesla supercharger, you literally just plug it and walk away. Um, which is what ultimately would be great that they're all linked, the car just linked to your car like uh, this is. Um, I'm now pulling up to 80 kilowatts, so it leads me to believe that these are 150 kilowatts and just because I'm not pre, uh, pre-conditioned, uh, that's probably the reason why. But yeah, well done GridServe, uh, another good installation and um, Long may you push out these uh, these installs across the country. I am seeing a lot more of these and other um, charging companies um, pop up. So 
Charging infrastructure is just getting better on a weekly basis, not even a, a yearly basis, a weekly basis. There's new installs going in all the time. So, um, you know, it's helpful for people like me. Yes, I've got a Tesla, it's a lot easier at home now. Um, I still don't have home charging. Hearts County Council still haven't pulled their finger out about um, doing a, um, a channel across the the path so we'll see what happens with that but to be honest if grid surf coming in stevenage i may not actually need it in any way so we'll see how that goes anyway quick video um hope you find it interesting if you do like share subscribe um thanks for everything else see you later bye